Hello, my name is Danielle Donovan, Clinical Risk Manager with the Healthcare Practice Group at Parker Smith & Feek. Today, I'm going to talk about how to handle an allegation of sexual misconduct. Employers are responsible for creating a safe care environment of zero tolerance, abuse, assault, or sexual misconduct. Risk managers, along with HR and senior leadership, should work together to quickly investigate, resolve, and prevent these behaviors from occurring. Consider incorporating the following steps into a plan of action. One, ensure the patient is safe and comfortable. Assign a member of the same sex to care for the patient, a chaperone, or place the patient in a room closer to the nurse's station. The patient may need emotional, pastoral, or social services. Two, separate the staff member involved. HR should interview the employee as soon as possible. Consider placing them on administrative leave or removing them from providing care to that patient until an investigation can be completed. Interview any witnesses if possible. Three, huddle with leadership. After completing interviews, set up a meeting with the interviewers, leadership, security, communications, and quality staff to discuss the outcome of the investigation confidentially. All files should be included in an incident report. Four, conduct mandatory reporting. Your facility may have mandatory reporting requirements. Understand the timeframes and proper points of contacts for reporting. For example, the Department of Health, the Medical Commission, or local authorities. If the patient is considered a vulnerable adult, check if reporting to Adult Protective Services is required. Five, notify your broker or insurance carrier. There are many associated exposures with sexual misconduct, including professional liability claims and regulatory site visits. Even if your investigation concludes a staff member is innocent, it is good practice to notify your broker about a potential incident or to obtain support throughout this process. To learn more about how your company should handle an allegation of sexual misconduct, contact an experienced insurance broker or risk manager. Thank you for listening.